Hello and welcome to today's English lesson. My name is Stuart. In today's lesson, we're looking at words that we use when we talk about the media. Let's go to the intro. Now, as I said, today's lesson is looking about words that we use when we talk about the media, okay? And I'll just point out quickly that media is a plural form, okay? The traditional singular form is medium, but in today's English, we can use media in both a plural and a singular way, okay? So we can say the media are, or if we think about the media collectively, we can also say the media is, okay? So it's become common nowadays to use uh, both this word in a plural and a singular form. Now, when we talk about the media, we talk about different types of media. So, for example, we have broadcast media, print media, digital media, and electronic media. Broadcast media would be television or radio, things that are broadcast. Broadcast is also a form of electronic media as well, because obviously they are broadcast electronically, televisions, radios, etc. Print media, newspapers, magazines, and digital media, the internet and mobile, okay? So that would be an example of digital media. Media can be traditional, it can be new, it can be mainstream, and it can be alternative. So for example, traditional media, okay, the traditional media, the traditional newspapers, the radio stations, the television stations, the things that we have had in our lives for a long time. New media, podcasts, for example, uh, internet, things like YouTube, for example, this could be considered a new type of media. Mainstream media and alternative media. Mainstream media is the media that uh, is the most common, okay? So if your country has popular newspapers or television stations that are trying to uh, reach a lot of people, that is known as the mainstream media, okay? The mainstream media. In the UK, mainstream media would be the BBC would be mainstream, and in the US, NBC, CBS would be mainstream media. And the alternative media, okay, which are the, it's the opposite of mainstream, the alternative media channels that are dealing uh, with an alternative content, perhaps not a popular content, more limited, but nevertheless, they have their uh, viewers or they have their readers, and it is considered alternative media. We also talk about mass media, mass media, the media for the masses, okay, the media for the masses. Again, for example, the BBC is an example of mass media, the Sun newspaper mass media, okay, because they are uh, reaching out to the masses. Social media is a concept of the last 10 years or so. Social media, the Facebooks, the Twitters in this world, social media, um, uh, media that uh, everyday people have in their hands and you know now we are able to publish things with uh, social media. Uh, and the TV, the radio, the newspapers and the magazines are called media outlets. It's where the media is uh, distributed, okay? The outlets, media outlets. The role of the media is traditionally to inform. Uh, some people say that media should be objective or that uh, radio stations and television stations should be objective. Sometimes media is biased, which is the opposite of ob objective. And, the, and another word for objective is unbiased, okay? Biased meaning that you only get one particular point of view. So if we're talking about political news, sometimes we only hear one political point of view. It is biased. 
The media talks often about current affairs or current events, things that are happening in the world, okay? The refugee crisis in Europe, uh, if there's an earthquake somewhere in the world, it is a current event. And another role of the media is to create public opinion. Now, people that control the media are called barons or moguls or tycoons. Now, an example of a media baron would be Rupert Murdoch or media mogul, Rupert Murdoch, who is this uh, person that owns newspapers, he owns television stations. Uh, basically, he has a big chunk of the media. So he is a media baron or a media mogul or a media tycoon. Now, when we talk about the media, we use prepositions. For example, we say on the television or on the radio. We say in the paper. I read it in the paper. We say on social media. I saw it on social media. I saw it on Facebook. I saw it on Twitter. And if you are famous or you have your 30 seconds of fame, perhaps you are going to be in the media, okay? In the media. So when the Academy Awards are on, a lot of celebrities are in the media because the media wants to uh, show their celebrity. Now, thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the section below. Remember to share the video on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Pinterest, share it up. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good day. Bye.